Many of us must have visited the Red Fort where every year the national flag is hoisted by the Prime Minister on Independence Day. But how many of us know the historical significance of the monument? The Dalmia Bharat Group under the central government's Adopt a Heritage scheme is showcasing the history of the 17th century monument to visitors. The initiative comprises three major attractions. A walk-through museum presenting the entire story of the construction of Red Fort, a light and sound show named Jai Hind on India's history, and a projection mapping show called Madhubhumi capturing the journey of Indian culture over 5000 years. The museum is housed in a barrack which was once used by the British army in the 19th century. The barrack has been renovated as a multi-story Red Fort center which takes visitors through the history of Delhi through 3D installations and a 360 degree film. Almost 80 to 90% of Red Fort, the site the, the buildings yeah. inside Red Fort were destroyed by the British after the first war of independence of 1857. Then there were about 13 barracks that were constructed by the British inside Red Fort to house their soldiers. Uh, this barrack was given to us uh, because it was used by the army and because it was not really treated as a heritage monument. Obviously there were layers of, of plaster and paint and everything as you will see some photographs of that uh, that we have shown. So we did the entire conservation work for this building. We peeled off all the uh, plaster and the paint and everything to expose the big work. And then we used the original line, no cement, even though we are a cement company, we did not use any cement anywhere except for uh, a couple of walls in the kitchen. But everything else was done with lime. The museum gives a glimpse of the cities of Delhi before the Red Fort was built. Accompanying the tourists is a guide throwing light into the history of Red Fort, which was built over a period of nine years and considered a pinnacle of the Mughal architecture. There is also an interactive wooden board which shows what was going around the world during Shah Jahan's timeline. Another attraction is a depiction of Chatta Bazaar, the first of its kind roofed bazaar by an actor who is dressed up as a shopkeeper during the Mughal era. Near the exit is a unity room with an interactive musical wall where Vande Mataram will be played with whichever musical instrument you tap on to. There is also a mirrored room with shiny Ashok Chakras which represent the innumerable sacrifices made by the freedom fighters. Around the evening, the fort is illuminated and ready for a high-tech light and sound show, Jai Hind. It is a dramatic presentation of the history of India from the 17th century to the present day. The tickets for the show range between Rs. 500 and 1,500. It is a fusion of several performances including mesmerizing dance performances projection mapping and puppets. The one-hour show is narrated by actor Amitabh Bachchan, who takes us through different timelines of history. From welcoming the Emperor Shah Jahan to the fort with drums and trumpets to portraying the battle of power between the Mughals, the show captures various events during the period. Nearly 60 dancers and actors perform the show six days a week.